Hey there guys, Seth Cole, and uh, welcome to another NSRA diecast review. For those of you that uh, have, have followed me on Twitter, and for those of you that saw it on my Skype, you know about this already, and uh, yeah, it has arrived. So I'm going to be doing a diecast review. Um, one thing I've noticed is that I haven't really been getting a whole lot of diecast up to date, and so I wanted to get one um, that was... More within, you know, present day. This is from last year, but it's like a more up-to-date car than what I've been recently getting. So, uh, this is what it is. Trevor Bain, 2013 uh, Motorcraft Ford. Slightly different, though, which you will see when we show you when I show you the box. Um, the light is kind of glaring up there. kind of wish it wasn't. Maybe I could turn it this way. There we go. That's a little better. So, um... As you can see, uh, this is, I think, the first one I've actually bought that was made by the Lionel NASCAR Collectibles Company, too, which I'm pretty excited about. So, um, we're going to look at the box here real quickly. Trevor is a very happy boy. And uh, it's got some kind of a thing there, too, a uh, official Ford thing. You can, for a cell phone, you can win something. I don't know what it's about, but it's got the NASCAR hologram. And then on this side, Trevor Bain's car... Uh, basically the same thing over on this side. Uh, it is Action, and it is licensed with RCCA. And as you can see, it's 2013, 20-year anniversary of the Action Collectibles. Now, this is the thing that we got to keep the best view on, and it's not going to show it. Doggone it. Well, I'm just going to read it to you. This is Trevor Bain, number 21, Motocraft Quick Lane, 2013 Fusion, color chrome so this is a special kind and it's one out of and you can't see it it's right there right there it says one of 96 that were made so uh, that's a big reason why I bought this one because I wanted to buy some special kind of one and this one only 96 were made and I thought you know what sold <laughs> it uh, cost me 40 bucks but it was free shipping so uh, there's the little card you always get with your purchase of a thing Lionel Racing Collectibles on the Styrofoam. Pretty cool. Alright, so I've gotten the uh, the thing out of the box. I needed two hands because the uh, thing is open a bit. So let's uh, take it out and see what we got. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That is one nice car. I had opened this beforehand, as you can tell by the way I opened up that Styrofoam. But um, I'm going to be very careful taking this out of the box here just a minute. This is pretty, pretty good car, and I don't want to do anything that's going to wreck the thing. I'm going to slide it out here. It appears to be stuck in the styrofoam. Well, that's always good. What? Come on. It is stuck in the styrofoam. Well, <laughs> okay. So uh, I'll try and give as best a review as I can from here. There's the front, uh, the Ford Fusion grill, Ford and the 21. Over on the other side, I believe it says Wood Brothers. And then hopefully you can guys can see the side. There's the 21 quick lane. I can't believe it's stuck in the styrofoam. On the top, Motocraft and the 21, Trevor Bain's name. It's too bad it's not the year he won the 500, but that's okay. Motocraft and Ford on the hood. Ford Auto Parts on the rear, and then the back is the same way. And then, of course, there's Trevor Bain's name with the American flag. And then FordParts.com uh, on the back. But all in all, this is probably one of the best die cast I've bought. And, yeah, I did put the deck lid back down. And I don't like the way the light's glaring on it again. So, sorry I couldn't take it out for you guys to see, but I did look on the back. I don't know if you can see it. It is number 46. I think you can see it right there. Yep. 00046. Number 46. So, uh, yeah, short diecast review, but uh, really looking forward to setting this one up. I'm planning on getting a display case as soon as I can display all my diecast. But I haven't gotten one yet. But uh, thanks for tuning in. 
and uh, there may be more diecast down the way. So stay tuned. Bye.